Yes. Um, Preeti, can you unmute the team or can you unmute everybody for yes, a minute? Yes. Yeah, yeah, I'll do it now. This is very overwhelming, Shobha, really. Yeah, ma'am. <laughs> let's let us begin. Oh. Um, let us sing. Yes, Rama. Rama and Manjali together. Wow. Happy birthday to you. 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 May God bless you. Bless you. May God bless you. Happy and birthday. May, and may we walk soon, okay? And run. Yes. Yes. Oh, <laughs> so I don't need it in my mind, but also. And Kali Falls for you. <laughs> <laughs> thank you very much for making this so special for me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hey. This Nirupama day, yeah, you're taking it away from her. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's our pleasure, ma'am. It's your 73rd birthday, ma'am's birthday. Yes. She is as young at, as, at her heart as she was always like, you know, and she's the most charming lady of this um, and the heart of our NJ. Okay, friends. So you definitely deserved it, ma'am. Still 27 years to go. <laughs> That's very true. Very true. It's a special figure. 72 to 27. <laughs> Uh, thank you, thank you very much. Good, good. The whole team being there, it's a big thing for me. And yes. the whole team, how it has worked and how we have done in the last two years since COVID has been amazing. I am so proud of it. And I love everybody in the team. And I love all these people who come to us every, every, every uh, webinar. So yes, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Yeah. NGH team and NGH family. Our participants are also wishing you, ma'am, happy birthday. And they love your spirit. <laughs> okay. Okay. So, uh, uh, ma'am, uh, will you like to say something? Just open the webinar. Then I'll introduce uh, Dr. Nirupama and then we'll start with her uh, uh, lecture. So, I really was uh, quite excited because, you know, Nirupama and I have, uh, we have started the same journey just like Shobha. So many of us are, you know, the same journey. We did ICR, we did something else because we know that we everything gives us something more and more and more. And today also we are carrying on. And uh, Nirupama and I have done even uh, uh, the FHPC. Other something, and now we have done yeah, FH, FHPC. FHPC. And uh, yeah, so we are very happy that we are continuing our journey, even of learning continuously and sharing. The more we share, the more we learn, actually. That's what we found in these webinars, roundtables, CMEs, everything, and the journal. As much as we put in, we get more, more than when we just study. So I advise everybody to continue this whole thing. And I want to say about Narupama that she's really, you know, quite a magnet. I mean, she collects everybody and all the various groups she's associated with. And she's so friendly and so calm and gets everybody together and gets the best out of people. So uh, I expect her to go a long way. Yeah. Thank you, madam. Thank you. Thank you, so <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you ma'am. Yes. So Dr. Vishwala ma'am has already introduced uh, Dr. Nirupama, but uh, just to add uh, some of it, like she's practicing homeopathy since more than 30 years. She's a very senior homeopath and she's a very good friend of uh, most of us in the this. She's a very good friend of mine. And but she's very passionate about learning. And that is how she has started her journey from ICR, then Dr. Barwalia's Profil Barwalia Foundation, then uh, uh, she has worked on to sex education, which I think some of us must have heard her and she has given a very good lecture in our SSMS on uh, sex education. And in the homeopathy, because, you know, being into the practice and very passionate learner, so she wanted to go more and more deeper into it. So she got associated herself with Dr. Shankaran's uh, uh, learnings and Dr. Mahesh Gandhi's learnings. Also, she is associated with HHF. 
so with all this you know she is trying to learn homeopathy through whatever possible means that she is trying to get and then she is wonderful person in connecting everything and you know trying to give share with us and uh, help us learn homeopathy into a, a very good way and if you see today's our uh, um, uh, the uh, today's topic tagline also, also which is very attractive <laughs> and produced a lot of inquisitive and curiosity into a lot of our uh, participants that what is this what is this like i heard some of them in some of the groups talking about this tagline you know that wow this is a wonderful tagline so mm -hmm. let us uh, hear from dr nirupama what she wants to share with us she is going to present to us one two cases one case into a very big into the detail through which we will learn this remedy in a way that we will be able to apply this into our practice in a very good way so and then second case she will present in to support this uh, first case and the learning of the whatever we will learn right nirupama yes 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 so okay i hand over uh, the platform to dr nirupama and uh, will uh, let let her share her case yes nirupama so Thank you, Madam. Thank you, Shobha, for such a wonderful introduction. So even I, through so many platforms, I'm learning, 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 and somewhere I got so much connected is through PM. When I studied PM, I thought that this is something should be taught from first year of homeopathy. Like every stage of PM is so important, and we study so much psychology, psychiatry. But somehow not able to connect everything. And this PM, I think we are able to connect everything. So just see how is this case connects all the aspects of this psychology and psychiatry. So I'll share. Yes, yes, Nirupam. So I'll directly start with the case. So the, this is very simple case. This uh, 18 years old boy came with acne vulgaris, lot of acne on face, but not very prominent. And he had some fungal infection in the axilla. So there's a small background here. His father used to come to me for a male type of baldness. And uh, he was so much affected with that male type of baldness that uh, he was desperate. He, Every week he will ask, it's not improving, it's not improving. I say, it's very difficult to treat male type of baldness and especially when it's genetic, it's difficult. And that time he said, Ki, my son says, Ki, you look horrible, do something for your hair. It's very horrible to see your hair going. So probably that time, I don't know whether this uh, it is this patient or not, but now after taking case, I felt Ki, this is this patient only Ki, who said father like this, Ki, you have to work on your hair. So that is the background. So uh, a patient came with acne, with which uh, leaves a lot of scars on his face. There were big pimples, the, there was swelling, there was pus. And then he said there is a fungal infection on in his arms. There is no itching, but it leaves ma uh, discoloration. So see, uh, I have taken case as patient said, uh, and you have to see how patient is talking and how is his to and fro movement. like. What is really bothering him? That you have to observe that. Huh? So patient said, Ki, I'm very conscious of my acne. I take so much care. I wash my hair, uh, face so many times. I'm applying so many things, but I'm just not able to stop it. So many pimples and they're not ready to subside. It leaves dark scars on my face. I'm so conscious of it. See, I go out, I talk with people, I mingle with my friends, but it affects my confidence. If acne are there, my whole concentration goes towards my acne. See, people will have bad judgment about me. They will say, you don't look good. But that's not true, doctor. It's just the acne. So, uh, second question was on fungal infection and he directly said, doctor, I'm a good swimmer. I'm a competitive swimmer and I've won the bronze medal, a silver medal for my school. But these marks which came on my axilla, I'm so conscious of it. It leaves dark pigmentation in my axilla. I'm so conscious 
I left swimming. I just left it completely. I don't want to swim again. See, he was very pre. See, now he is talking about his acne. Then he is talking about his consciousness. Then he is talking about the swimming, which he left. A competitive swimmer who completely left the swimming, and now he is talking about his marks. I was pretty average in my school. I used to get 80, 82 percent, but in my home, 80, 85 percent nahi chalta. It just not allowed. My younger brother scores more than me, but my parents they do not like my 85 percent. They never said that your marks are less or you are useless. But they always compare me with my other friends. They will say, Dekho, uske kitne aai hai? I feel so bad. They keep comparing me with anyone who gets more marks. See, I have also studied hard. You have to give me some credit for my hard work. But no, they will keep comparing with others and they will just say, Ki, uh, your marks are not enough. I want to be become pilot. I'm preparing for the exams. My father is pilot too. Why I'm doing this? Because then he'll be able to support me. Now, if I'm in a problem, he will support me. See, he's talking about this school marks and then suddenly he's saying, I want to become a pilot. Huh? See here, all depends on your performance. But too many restrictions at home. See what he's talking here. All depends on your performance. See, when I'm appearing for such competitive exams, my performance will be seen. But immediately he says, but there are too many restrictions at home. I'll be financially free if I become pilot early. So he was trying after 12th itself. So it's a two years course. So if I become pilot early, I'll be financially free. I don't have to ask for the money. So what is financial independent for you? No one will ask me any question. What are you doing? Where are you going? What is your uh, today's plan? No, no one can question me anything. I can tell that person just to shut up. Close your mouth. Abhi to sunne ko milta hai na? To koi kaam ka nahi hai? To kuch kamata nahi hai? So what about this course uh, pilot? Here they fairly judge you. It's a big responsibility, doctor. All depends on your performance. People treat you here as an adult, not like a school kid where parents run behind the children. I'm a like, here you are a grown-up boy. You don't have to run behind me. Academically, uh, there is a lot of freedom. So if child is average in school, Everyone neglects that child. See his concern now. Huh? If child is mischievous, no one cares for him. Then these children give, give up completely because no one is there for them. Even debate competition is judged on your marks. No fair, fair opportunities in life. It's not fair, doctor. All biased decisions. All are trying hard. But it's not fair to deny their opportunities. Other kids also deserve it. See what is he good at. Look at his talent. Don't just look at the shortcomings. I want to go abroad. I want to study there. But parents say, your marks are not that great that you'll get admission in Stanford University. But my dream is to go to Stanford. I want to become aeronautical engineer. See what he wants to become. Huh? What is complaining about what parents are saying. So in this case, it's very important to see the type of parenting and how child is reacting to the parenting and what, how are his action plans. Huh? Everything is important. Like in ICR, we used to do TFCAR. So that is very important to understand any person. Ki how is he working over his problem? So my dream is to go to Stanford University. I want to become aeronautical engineer. I want to learn about cryptocurrency too. In childhood, I was compared a lot with other people. Anyone, anyone in, in family who gets more marks, like my cousins, my friends, anyone who performs better than me, who gets more marks. 
I used to feel lost. No one feels happy. Whatever I do, no one is happy with my performance. I feel happy when my brother does well. At least no one says anything to him. So generals were taken. So appetite is good. I used to eat a lot, lot of outside food. I was very obese. He was, I think, around 125 kgs. And he lost 25 kgs in lockdown. And so he avoids sweets. But he has a lot of desire for sweets, pastries, chocolates. His thirst is quite high. He drinks six to seven liters of water. Dreams are very characteristic. Just see what are the dreams. I see in dream that I have someone to talk to me. Someone who is there for me. I can uh, go to that person anytime and talk to the person. This is dream number one. And second room, I, I do something in my dream that I can go do any, anything what I want to do. Like what? Doing something which I want to do, like going out anytime. As simple as going out at night 2.30. I don't have to answer anyone. Where are you going? What are you doing? This is time to go. No. I'm going anytime out. That is what I see in my dream. Because I don't want any, I don't want to give any answers. I want that. I'm not answerable to anybody. If I'm doing something, aapko kuch taklif nahi, see his language, huh? aapko kuch taklif nahi hona chahiye. So much anger within na, for the restrictive parenting. I have to ask for everything here. In our home, we have to ask, can I go down? May I do this? How about this, Mama? So if I say I'm going down, Mama, mujhe daat pad jati hai. No manners of talking. So thermal is hot. He gets profuse sweat. See, everything as patient said, it has gone in that order, huh? I have big fears of financial dependency on my family. I don't like dependency on them. I have a lot of anxiety before any competitive exam, uh, exams. I, I just love animals. I love wild animals. I like chirping sound of the birds. I just enjoy sparrow. Uska awaj bohat meetha hota hai. But Day by day, sparrows are reducing. I just love plants. I love wild plants, which does not need any caring, which does not need any watering. I, I like to read about investments. I love zazz. I love guitar. I love dogs. I'm going to keep it when I, I'll go abroad. So this is the case. So any anything coming to your mind? Any remedies? Shubha, anything is there in bo chat box? Uh, no. The people were listening. So you want to take up some of the uh, this views of some of the participants, right? Yes, few views of whatever they have understood in this case. It's a small case because he was 18 years old. So usually that age children doesn't talk much, but still I felt he, he talked a lot. Okay. And on his own, he said so many things about his family, about his career, everything. Yeah. So, uh, yes, um, uh, participants, yes, uh, my friend, uh, will some of you like to share your understanding? Uh, if you can raise uh, your hands, we can unmute you. Or you can write the remedies or something. Yeah, like you that. can write down or in the uh, in the chat box. Pella saying image is much more important. Naja. Okay. Hello. See. It's a very nice input. It's a very closely coming remedy. So Naja is a good uh, this thing. Any other thought process. Think about how his child talking, how uh, boy, how he's talking, what are his complaints, how he's getting affected with this, how is the parenting, how child is reacting to this type of parenting, how are his future plans. 
everything just how are his dreams how he connects to the environment around think about that so only naja has come na so we'll go no, ahead there is another somebody has written uh, just he he seeks libertinism adolescent yes. phase of development yes very good someone said animal bird um mm -hmm. domination by parents restriction wants to be free feels domination child yes. meets someone who doesn't judge him and just accept him as he is accepted um some are saying bird themes some are saying lacken one some one doctor said lacken think also one ha huh? one doctor said cactus restriction freedom okay very very good inputs ha huh? uh, shobha uh, pankajini sahu has raised hand acha just a minute huh? yeah she is unmuted pankaj ji you can share ha namaste ma'am ha namaste ha ye bachcha to apne hisab se hard work karta hai lekin ghar wale iske hard work ko appreciate nahi kar pate isko compare karte hain aur niche dikhate hain jo criticize karte hain ye isko acha nahi lagta hai राइट और इसके ऊपर घर वाले रोक ठोक लगाते रहते हैं तो इससे ये बाहर आना चाहता है इसीलिए और इसी से बचने के लिए भी ये खुद इंडिपेंडेंट बनना चाह रहा है और इसका एम्बिशन है कि मैं ये कुछ बनना चाहता हूँ ऐसा बोला और रेमेडीज कमिंग टू योर माइंड वेरी गुड कॉन्ट्रीब्यूशन एवरी सेंटेंस वॉज इम्पोर्टेंट वॉट एवर यू शेयर और इसके so, हिसाब से इसको ड्रीम भी आ रहा है ड्रीम में ये देख रहा है कि इसका फ्रीडम इसको मिल गया है और ये अपने हिसाब से बाहर जा पा रहा है यस yes. और ये इतना बड़ा बनना चाहता है कि इसको कोई कुछ बोल ना सके यस yes. yes very important to understand now you just share your remedy so we can go ahead mai mere remedy to mind mein nahi aa raha hai theek hai theek hai mute yourself so uh, very good co contribution by pankaj ji ne and very good remedies we got on the uh, chat box like naja lack can cactus so these are very closely coming remedies and we have to differentiate these remedies so now we go what are the issues in this case also many are saying about uh, bird remedies because uh, they think that it's a issue of freedom i think He's saying is freedom with adolescent age, age and wants freedom so is it bird someone said like pelinum like yes. can also like pelinum also hmm. so if you see birds are very higher in evolution that is the adult mature adult stage uh, if if you see the whole case how it's going home out home out home out you have to understand that what is going on to and to one side he is talking about home then he is talking about the performance then he is talking about the home then he is talking about the school so this is very important in this case so what is he struggling with so what i felt is this image problems with parents restricted feeling freedom want of very rebellious person and he wants to go out how uh, pankajini said na for his growth that is important to understand he want his feeling restricted inside where there is no growth and he wants to go out for his growth and that's why he talked about the work he talked about the money cryptocurrency was the money so going out and earning is very important theme here and very the way uh, pankajini said na he want to grow very tall she said and see the cactus once he leaves home how grow, tall it grows so cactus 200 weekly was given and 
whole acne settled down, his fungal infection went. And so basic theme of cactus, if they're restricted at home, they die. And if they go out, they grow very fast and they need a lot of space to grow. So basic theme is of space, air, open. He said, I want to become aeronautical engineer. I want to become pilot. But at the same time, what he said, my father is there to guide me, support me. So what is this stage of development? It's to and fro. So I want that protected home, but at the same time, I don't want that protection. I don't want un unnecessary nurturing and I want to go out. This unnecessary nurturing restricts me. So that is the whole theme of this case. So if you see cactus here, what Dr. Shankaran says, how, what are the sensations there? Feel constricted. Feel made smaller. He said, na, my, how my parents say, Itna koi marks milta hai tujhe. So made smaller, shrunk, contracted, bound, trapped, pressed, downtrodden, oppressed, clutched, weighed down. So you also get that feeling when patient was sharing all this thing, right? And passive reaction is trapped. That's why people came to bird, freedom and trap. But you have to see what is the stage of development of bird. So active reaction is expansion, becoming big, boundless, released. I want to go out. I want to become aeronautical engineer. I want to study in Stanford University. All this is a theme of expansion. And what uh, PM says, so it comes under the karyophyllidae where there is struggle for separation. So if you see, this is the womb stage. So it is the nine month old baby in the womb who wants to go out of the womb. So it is the kick which child gives to the womb and starts the labor process to come out. Creatively, if you see how many times you have to leave your home, you feel like leaving when that home is restricted. So one, is the nine month of pregnancy when you want to come out in this world, but then again, you come in the lab. That is how child is going ahead, then again, coming back, going ahead and then coming back. Second stage is the adolescent stage. When that is the stage when you want this, your protected home, you don't want, you want to go out and parents say, nee, nee, bhi chota hai, nee, ja. so this adolescent Typically wants parents only in difficulty. They don't want always when you hover around them. They just hate that. So that, that time also you want to leave your home. And see, adolescent is the stage when you practice the adulthood. And you want to become adult. And everything he said like this, no? pilot is the theme where you take a lot of responsibilities. You don't have to run behind. It's a grown-up stage. Everything is said, how is practicing that stage? And typically, karyophyllidae here, you get all the themes of early childhood, school age, and adolescent stage. So we'll just understand this case, and then uh, we'll see one video. Actually, Shobha, I forgot to uh, put this video. So if you can uh, just uh, keep it ready next time. Okay. If we get time, we'll share at the end. Yeah. At present, you finish with the case. We'll I'll see. finish with the case. Okay. So how he's talking about the acne, na? I'm so conscious about it. People will pass bad judgment about it. You don't look good. So typically, adolescent who is so much sensitive for his looks. And if looks is not good, they stop going out. Fungal infection, same stay, uh, thing he said. I don't want to go out. Anna? And he's a competitive swimmer. Competition is the big fire. Is Anna? That makes you compete with others. So cactus has a lot of anger within. And they keep fighting with everything. And that anger is seen when he was talking about other kids who are average, who are mischievous. And when they don't get the fair opportunities, the way he was talking, you can feel that. So how is it that 85% of our house doesn't work? You are useless. See, he said parents never said that. 
but it is his inner feeling if i don't perform well you will be useless and that's why that need to go out and grow it so much and that's why he's so sensitive to comparison with other people definitely he was hard work he's a hard working child who wants a lot of appreciation and if you see the parenting style here we know there are four parenting style out of which here is the authoritarian parenting style this type where parents they don't allow you to think they don't allow you they don't give you freedom to think and you have to follow my way that that is the way it it's rule of the family that's why you have to follow and the, what is this child is doing see in such type of parenting there are the two things can happen either child will become very meek or child will rebel and here what this person is doing is rebelling is fighting that restriction he is not liking that restriction but because in that stage in between he is not yet adult enough which can go out and perform and he is not that small enough which will remain inside so he is doing that to and fro typically adolescent to and fro movement too many restrictions at home i want freedom i want freedom how many times he said i want freedom and there is so much restriction at home why freedom so no one can question me i can tell person to shut up see to whom he is saying shut up that is very important what he shared in the case and then he is saying shut up so so much fire inside so much rebellious inside so much anger within so becoming a pilot fair judgment big responsibility for the performance again all school age issues people treat me here as an adult and grown up so adolescent typically want you know to treat me like an adult i'm grown up because the height grows more than father but father treats him like a child so they say father my chappal is bigger than your chappal so you have to give that freedom right so i want to go abroad i want to study out so the whole focus was on going out and having a good growth in life and so much masculine energy everything is masculine in this case parents marks are not good stand for so all this is the whole focus is on the performance fire and going out and then he said about this space aeronautical engineer cryptocurrency the masculine the money part and the beautiful dream came i have someone to talk to me what is this when child doesn't want nurture when child doesn't want to stay at home what is this i have someone to talk to someone who is there for me so this is the typically stage now where if i am in a problem you help me you support me but if i am trying something don't unnecessarily restrict me like many times you we say na ki raat ke 12 baje don't go at such night come early don't go to the parties so eleven typically 17 18 years old children they go for so many parties and night night out and all parents are worried so typically they rebel that so that is that stage is very important to understand and then he said doing something which i want to do like going out at night to 13 no one can ask me what are you doing where are you going so so much is the need for freedom so much is the need for space and the growth i am not answerable to anybody and the typically he gave the sensation of the case i love wildlife animals in wild who do not need care why wild has come do we do, uh, do anything for them i like wild life plants which does not need any caring which does not need any watering and here was the understanding ki he doesn't want water i don't want your care i don't want your nourishment i just hate the feminine element so cactus is something who is practicing the masculine and because you are practicing masculine it you you overdo it it's too much of the masculine and it's a rejection of feminine element complete rejection it kicks your womb and come comes out because womb is so small you are not growing now 
So now the process is you have to come out of it. Then only you'll grow. And that's why it's a first masculine impulse. It's the first time fire is experienced and first time you learn to go out. And you grow outside, right? Ultimately, but you are coming again in the mother's lap. So you need that mother's guidance, warmth, everything. But before that, you reject that. So when I was going through the uh, all these uh, rubrics, the beautiful rubric which I saw, see typically anxiety, chest in, extending upward, chest in, bronchitis. And then if you see uterus, See, so many uterine complaints and so many heart complaints. See, rheumatism of the heart. Typically, heart and uterus is the presentation of the feminine energy. And whatever you reject will come back to you. You are rejecting the feminine and you are developing illness at that level. So, a little bit about the karyophyllidae. So, it's a third subclass. Where third subclass typical it's a struggle for separation coming out of water everything there they're coming out snakes are in third subclass that's why naja had come because they reject the water snakes are very close to periophyllidae because they reject water and there is huge fire in them here also if you see patient has a lot of fire so <clears throat> see all these uh, seeds if you see what, what it reminds you see double wall protection and the baby inside and is it not look like a uterus typically see so basically need to separate from womb they do not want any kind of restriction because restriction causes a lot of tightness inside where you feel suffocated and you want to go out for the air so need to go out want air so there is, all these are red in color. So there is a lot of fire elements. Fire elements. Seeds are curved like embryo. It looks like a fetus inside with double wall protection. And these karyophyllidae, they adapt to a very harsh and ex extreme climate. That's why you see in, in desert where there is no one, there is no water. But still they survive there because uh, that strength is there in them. So basically what is the theme? Separation from Womb means anything womb-like structure, separation from womb, mother, parents, anything. So you, you, whatever restrict you, you want to separate from it. Too much smothering smothers me. So don't, patient said, no, he, you don't have to run behind me. I'm a grown-up child. Struggle for individuality. I have my own individuality. I can do something. So that is struggle is going on. And that's why is that separation. So basically the whole focus is on separation and being engulfed feeling. If I don't separate, I'll get engulfed. I'll get killed. I'll get suffocated. And this is very important. I feel hindered because of great power. See this picture. That's why I shared so great powers. So, so mothers are seen like a monster here. They, they literally feel my mother is monster. She doesn't allow me to do anything. Feel hindered by great power and desire to act according to their own will. I want to do what I want to do. Extremely rebellious and hindered feeling. So there is no what... So basically, I don't want water. Cactus doesn't need much water. If you give water, cactus is going to die. So no more water, please. And they have a lot of prickly, thorny, pri uh, prickle uh, thorns on them. So Shanti means talk with that patience with them. So prickly, thorny side is very evident when they come to the clinic or when they talk with their parents. And the whole focus is on detachment and separation. Fight with feminine element. Contraction versus expansion. They, they contract so fast. So it's a nine-month complete labor process. So uterus keeps contracting to bring baby out. So now womb is restricting. It is no more nurturing. No growth. So th this is the cactus grandiflorus. This is the plant which is used for the medicine. And 
cactus ha, uh, uh, cactus is called as night blooming plant so all aggravation in the night huh? what is night when you relax you don't work you sleep they don't like that so all aggravations are in night so action is on heart and circulatory muscles basically circulatory muscle which causes sort of constriction and see what will happen if it it will constrict it will give rise to hemorrhages so you see a lot of constriction a lot of hemorrhages in these uh, uh, cactus cases see anxiety chest in extending up for delusion smaller he is delusion smaller things grow so things grow smaller delusion he is about to die so much is the constriction i am about to die now so you see na lot of post mature delivery the where baby die still birth happens delusion he is caught in a wires fear happens something will fear suffocation of so these are very characteristic rubric which we have studied in maybe third year final year and we usually give it to angina or heart diseases but today if you see we can give it for acne also and if theme matches for any other illnesses so basically there is a rejection of feminine element water nurture body feels very tight and rough so there is a, a dilu uh, sensation in cactus huh? my body is feeling tight and wrapped up so what is wrapped up again you are going back to the womb stage as if caged in wire sensation as if heart is clutched and released clutched and released this is the hand gesture also comes in the cases many times alternately by an iron band as if expanding and contracting operation of chest aggravation 11 pm aggravation 11 pm better by open air so cactus is a desert plant it needs very less water too much water can kill the plant many fears related to water like uh, they will not drink much water they will get dreams of drowning they will get dreams of water uh, especially in migraine uh, there is strong aversion to the water so lot of theme about water but in our case if you see there was high thirst for water so maybe it's a polarity but usually there is fight with the water and this is the theme which is seen small small versus big contraction versus expansion up versus down attachment or the detachment so i'll take second case before that if group has any question any differentiation from developmental uh, stage if you see the naja you can remove automatically because naja has the mature stage of development who takes a lot of duties very family conscious so automatically it goes be then lack can was there lack can has lot of adequate feeling that's why even i had given first prescription lack can lot of adequate feeling is there lot of uh, low self esteem is there but what we miss is fight with parents what we miss that Did they just want to see mammals wants to remain in home for the protection, security, development, everything they want home for it. But the cactus wants to go out. Home is restricting, killing, not nourishing. While mammal home is nourishing. That is the big difference. And bird, bird, bird who had come, bird is very adult stage of uh, development where. they they have taken good responsibility of the family they have done everything good and now that uh, responsibility is burden for them because why it's uh, the connection is to the higher world it is not for the money here if you see cactus he said cryptocurrency he said stanford university he said usa bird is not bird is higher spirituality they want to explore what they want to do they, how i can uh, spiritually grow they are very compassionate in nature they want to do lot for the human but so if you see bird is the mature adult well especially when we say vanaprastha ashram like my grohastha ashram is over and i want to leave home for the betterment of the family uh, betterment of the world and betterment of me i want to explore me i want to go within so it's going within 
to explore myself. That is the stage of birth. This is very early stage. It's a adolescent stage where women adolescent two stages you see here where they are still a kid, children. They are not grown up. So that is the difference. Any other questions have come up, Shobha? Any uh, other difference yeah. they want? You want to take it up now or you want to share the second? I think better you share a second case and then we take it up. Because no, but the question here is that four subclasses are more feminine and this is strong masculine. Can you explain? So th fourth is the feminine where they want love, they want care, they want nourishment, everything they want. They are too much into feminine, uh, this thing. But third, they don't want feminine. There is a fight with mother. Why are you restricting me? I want to go out now. It's enough. That is the stage. And fourth, though, they, they're in connection with mother. No? So the doctor is asking first four subclasses are mm -hmm. more feminine. Yes. The cactus is in subclass. Three. Third, if you see uh, what there is a fight with water because it's a first impulse. I told you it's a first masculine impulse. So they practice it too much overboard. And that's why they're rejecting the feminine, but they're creating the disease feminine. If you see it's a strong aversion they have developed. But if you see ultimately what is they're saying, if there is a difficulty, I want to come back to the mother or father. If there is a problem, I need the shelter. See, home, uh, continuously, if you see, home, school, home, performance, home, space. So, continuously coming back is also there. If you see, continuous process, if you see, it's coming back. So, it's a fight. Basically, it's a fight with feminine. It's a rejection of feminine. That, that, is, uh, that is the difference. It is coming out in the world now. Because you are in the womb. You are in a third, ninth where you are full grown up and now you want to come out and experience the world. Or adolescent, now my growth is enough inside. Now I'm 18 years, let me go out and explore the world. So process is, is there. See? Enough of a nourishment. I have grown up enough. Let me go out. So it is not that the all four subclasses, first, two, second, third, fourth, all feminine. There's always be a struggle. So there will I be the word, you can see the struggle. Yes, struggle. Struggle for separation. If you see the heading, struggle for separation. So very strong. And if you see in third subclass, Karyophyllidae, if you see Cactaceae family, all I have taken few differentiation of the cactus family itself. You see all look like snake. Then if you see animal chart, in that you, you see snake is there in the third subclass below. So fire with the fight with the water, they reject the whole process is they reject water. They don't want. And because their whole focus is on their growth, they want to grow now. They want to go ahead in that. And that's why that struggle is there. Even what he talks about the cryptocurrency and money. That is the masculine the money, money. I want to earn. I want to show world that I can earn. And what is world? I want to show my parents, see, I'm grown up. I can earn. I can stand on my own legs. I can do anything and everything in this world. That is all. whole struggle is going on. The whole that case. Is, that, is is what, uh, that is what he wants. But he's not yes. yet achieved it. So it is yes. his thing. So it's still that struggle and that growth is coming up. So it, it, there is no clear cut. It's just feminine. It's just masculine. No, that thing is coming up and yeah, it is back and forth. So you, the masculine is coming up. It will be coming up every... Coming up, yeah. yes. So uh, if you see even adolescent age, if we see, they get very attracted to someone who is very macho type or someone who is very... Like I see nowadays kids only talk about the Ambani or someone who Bill Gates who grow very fast and very early. So children, they talk about that, right? So the whole focus is on growing fast, going ahead in life fast. So that typically, and nowadays we get a lot of, uh, I think we, uh, after I studied these cactus, I think I have four to five cases after that because we give so much on the platter and we protect them so much that they really feel restricted at home. 
So we get a lot of patients like that. And all of them, I have given uh, uh, some of the other snake only, and then I gave cactus and very good response, very good response. Yes, uh, any questions are there, Shobha, or I'll take up the image. books we should read to understand all this. Cactus, I uh, basically studied from search uh, uh, cases and then I studied from all the rubrics, whatever available in the repertories and the cactus, uh, whatever given. Means normal books. I have not used any special books or something. But basically, I connected everything through the PM understanding and what Shankaran gave sensation. From that, then I tried to understand everything. So Nirupama, I think uh, what they want is the P, the names of Dr. Shankaran or PEM books, I think. So that is PM what uh, so, we will write them in the book. In the yeah. chat. Uh, we will write down. There are three books that we will write down. Okay. Hmm? So I will take another case. And this case is very, very typical. Uh, this case has given all the typical what cactus can talk to you. So everything. So this child had come from US. And uh, she had a lot of loose motions that day. Multiple, she said 15, 16 times. And I'm feeling very, very weak. And uh, so she said, last five to six years, I have IBS. So that day she came in active and I was not having a lot of time. So whatever 15, 20 minutes I could gather symptoms, I took that. And she gave reasonably good history. So five to six years, these symptoms are there. And daily she gets... Uh, 14 to 15 loose motions. That is what she said. So uh, she has IBS, always had stomach issues, a lot of diarrhea. Once in 15 days, she gets watery mucus stool. There is no blood, but there are a lot of stomach cramps before, after stool, maybe for 15 minutes. 15, 16 was that day, but otherwise she said there is a frequent loose motion. And that day when she came, she said, I am feeling very fatigued. There is a brain fat difficult to get out of the bed. It's so hard to come out. So, and see her accent was very difficult to understand because she had come from the US and uh, very difficult to, I said, you talk a bit slowly, let me understand what you are saying. She was talking as a and I, I was finding it very difficult. So that also you have to understand why person is so much in a hurry. So immediately she said, my childhood, childhood was very rough, doctor. So communication, huh? again, see the communication, the first case and this is the second case. Otherwise, children usually do not talk uh, easily about their parents, their home. But they're that way, there's so much anger about their parents, they talk. So very rough childhood. My mom is pretty strict, abuse kind of stuff. She used to hit me. I grew up scared. I'm paranoid. Something will happen. She will get angry. Lot of fear. Lot of anxiety I developed. She kicked me out of home. They found contraceptives in my bags. Doctor, it's not something abnormal. All grown-up kids are having uh, contraceptives in their bag. What is new? In US, though, it's very normal. But my parents, they just do not like that. I did not talk to my mother for two years. I did not like the way they show their love. See, I do not like the way they show their love. They're very strict. They're very controlling. They're strict for everything. Strict for grades. Mother will hit me for my marks. See, familiar, first case and second case. Where is the focus? Parents wants marks. And I am also working for the marks then. No? Strict for grades. Mother will hit me. And they are strict about the boys type of stuff. I don't think anything wrong in that. I had a lot of anger towards them. A lot of anger issues with friends. That reflected because of parents only. A lot of anger on parents as they messed up my life. I could not adjust with my friends. Parents were so strict. I used to act out more. Means I used to express more anger because I just did not like their restriction. See how many times she said, huh? Strict, 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 strict. How many times? Four to five times. 
I get very scary dreams. I'm fighting with my mom. I'm very angry on her. I hurt her. I need to fight back. I'm punching somebody. I get dreams that there is an angry monster attacking the tree. See, this monster theme is very important in cactus. They feel the feminine energy is very monstrous. So if these children, if they grow up like this, they find it very difficult to adjust with their wife. They, they're extremely difficult to adjust with any feminine energy. So how this patient is also saying that, they have messed up my life. I have a lot of anger, anger issues and I could not adjust with my friends. And this anger is seen everywhere in their life in future because they are basically rebel people. An angry monster attacking the train. This is the monster is the big thing. I like nature. I like that smell of nature when you are watering the plant. I'm not into animals. If it's my dog, I will love. Otherwise, I will not nurture it. If it plants, if someone takes care of it, it's okay. I cannot take care. Even cactus does not survive in my room. It does not need water. Still, it does not survive. And I just gave cactus one dose that day. And her next day morning, she had come in the evening. And next day morning, I got follow-up. She woke up fresh. There is no weakness and there is no stomachache and loose motion. Just with one dose. Then we continued because she has a lot of PCOS issues and IBS definitely needs regular treatment. So again, if you see PCOS, what the disease she is creating? She is rejecting the feminine. She does not want uterus. She does not want uterine function. And ultimately, what is the result of PCOS? You don't nurture, right? You, there is an infertility. See, you have to understand what type of illnesses it creates. So this is all about the cactus. Uh, there are four remedies in this family. I'll just take, what is the time? I can explain. No? Uh, eight to, so well in time. So there are four remedies in this group, which are very, very similar. So if you are coming to cactus and cactus is not helping, please think about these remedies too. So there is a cactina which is have uh, acute mysum, a very good remedy for angina. It has sudden severe pain with migraine, severe pain in chest with migraine. So basically it starts with the migraine and then pain goes to the center of the chest. And then the typical symptom of angina, like perspiration, restlessness, everything. But the characteristic it, angina comes with the migraine and pain is in the center of the chest. So all the symptoms of cactus, if you see, and if you get this the uh, physical plane, this symptom, think of cactina. Then carigina gigantina. So this, this is the very gigantic uh, cactus. It grows very tall. I, I uh, personally felt it's a syphilitic myism. It is very much like snake. It has dreams of snakes extremely revengeful, extremely malicious. So a lot like uh, snake. But if you are getting, see snake has the adult stage of development, king series. So if you don't see the maturity and if you see the child type of, means toddler type of to and fro performance, adolescent, think of cactus and then a bit syphilitic myism, you can think of this remedy. Then third is Opuntia vulgaris. Again, a very much like snake. It, it is a typically leprous myism. Anger with a lot of cursing. They curse their parents. They curse God. They abuse their parents. So a lot of abusive nature to their own parents. And if you creatively think about the parent, you can creatively think how they can curse anyone, even God, everyone. And basically, they come with a lot of acne on face. A lot of acne. And the look is very thorny look. That prickly type of uh, acne you can 
seeing i have seen long back one patient like this literally used to look like thorn but i could not tell because i was not knowing this medicine then so uh, very much and this is our typical cactus which we see everywhere in mumbai right so you know, and, can and, i just make one comment you know this yes. picture of this cactus in gigantina it if you say you know like up yours they think so much revengeful and malicious how you how adolescents say up yours kind of you know that very yeah. funny picture it is ha yeah. And anurinum that way is not difficult to differentiate with cactus him. Anurinum is it is not similar. That's why I have not written everything. But anurinum has a very soft creativity. They are into music. They are into drumming. They are into spirituality. They they their way of disconnecting with the problem in the life is going into the escape world. That is. Uh, they just uh, do a lot of re uh, religion they are into religious ceremony they will go on doing drumming enjoying that type of and they disconnect totally so that is anholinum so these are the four remedies which comes very very close to the cactus oh so with this um, i think uh, if you want any information i can give but uh, i uh, i thought can not be able to cover uh, this much in one and a half hour so i took only two cases just one second ha huh? okay. yeah. so any questions are there shobha i'll stop share yes yes uh, nirupama wonderful wonderful presentation and wonderful cases thank you mm. so very good and uh, both have demonstrated the whole theory well right. and especially you know that thing about being completely feminine and being masculine it becomes a little more clear because there is no such thing as a complete divide even in the fifth where there lot of split you can see a lot of feminine there so even in the third because it is the womb and separation there always be the masculine urge to go up so that has come out very well both in your presentation and in answering the question so i think it has become clear to uh, the group also you know that they cannot just say feminine feminine and then masculine masculine it's never like that no, it's no, always it's mixed like and it's always a question of who which at that point in time wins plus uh, yes. the in connection with the inner age also where you are in the evolution yes. and you know, what i found when i was studying what i found characteristic is while studying i realized this anything which you Uh, learn first time you overdo it so masculine is the first impulse in cactaceae family and then you overdo it that's why there it's too much like you are practicing it too much and that's why you are rejecting the feminine that is what i felt while studying yeah so nirupama and uh, ma'am it is uh, what i was thinking or feeling is is it like uh, the way we see uh, miasmatic uh, presentations in all the cases like you know we say that some miasms are predominant so similarly it is not that only one miasm is there in every case mm -hmm. like only the case is only soric or only psychotic or only syphilitic or only tubercular whatever but maybe the one miasm is predominating so how ma'am said and what you are also saying is that at that moment of time which energy whether it is a masculine or a feminine which one is predominating that is what i think needs to yes. be seen right yes yes okay okay i have currently one more case uh, i think i do not have a big follow up but this girl said ki when i go home i feel so suffocated my nose gets she is coming for nose block my nose is completely blocked i'm not able to breathe and the moment i leave home she's dead like this i'm able to breathe and i feel so good my whole nose block goes away and then the whole theme also she focused on driving she focused on mother she focused on so many things and the everything fitted and last week only i gave and she said i'm 40% better and she suffering for so long that's yes, all Yeah. so you know that this brought out the domination of parent and when we say that we have to treat uh, children growing up like plants like how we treat plant we don't overwater them we don't go and hug them all the time so children yes. too, we have to leave them to grow on their own and not dominate 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 and push them down all the time and give a lot of support more than 
just uh, being strict and so these are parenting things which we have to teach parents because we are family physicians not always yes. see, but to back off that is the best way to let them grow yes very important that is yeah so nirupama there is also this on the similar line the one doctor is asking that uh, how how we can dd with domination as it is not in the rubric you know what you know? i didn't get the question how how you how we can dd this with the domination as the domination yeah, elements from dom so the, the remedy is not take no elements from domination is there but ultimately what is the process what are you feeling in the domination they feel so much restricted they feel so much suffocated uh, and then they want to go out so uh, how we used to do in icna tfcar thought feeling commitment action result so if you see all this uh, uh, we understand the process like how is the environment how i am relating the environment and how i am experiencing and what action i am taking so all this process is very important and that's why when i was studying cactus not much data is available so from pm i tried to study the rubrics and from that then sir uh, shankaran sir sensation and then i could understand these cases well okay uh, nirupama one doctor is asking can you please tell about the polygonals polygonalis so uh, below karyophyllidae is a polygonalis right ha huh. so that is the adolescent stage you uh, typically adolescent stage you will see so and but i have seen the cases which are there in that if you study i think phytoleca is there so if you study uh, in that mother side like rejecting the child anger towards child that type of rubrics are there i have not got cases yet so i have not studied that much but the other side of energy you see in those cases so i am not sure about that adolescent stage in uh, polygonalis but i have to study it i don't know if you have cases then only you will be able to study in depth right other cases you can just understand but your own cases take you to the deeper understanding azreen khan is asking how to come up and start thinking like this so yes it is a lifelong uh, learning that we are doing we are still doing it okay so you have to keep on learning and keep on understanding and you still feel that yes i can now understand a little bit more little bit more little bit more yes but okay. the very fact that you understand that there is this way of approaching that itself is you know a start yes yes and the homeopathy is so vast if you see it's an ocean so uh, you have to study so many things like so many things without that it's very difficult to understand remedy every aspect if you see is the incomplete aspect if you see somewhere again we will miss the remedy so maximum we have to study about the remedy from all the ang angles right nirupama one another doctor is asking uh, can you please share about beta vulgaris i don't know about beta vulgaris i have not studied okay mm. so i've given the names of two books you can begin with okay foundation book of personal evolution model by dr mahesh kandhi and dr shankaran schema right right yeah somebody has said that what is bothering the patient you can begin that mm. is true you have to understand that and what is exactly all the so everything comes into everything that you studied so far will come into play your psychology and your materia medica you will not find rubrics but you have to interpret in very many ways and then you have to understand in general what is the and so that is why as we go along things will become clearer to you yes thank you thank you nilupama a very good thank case. you madam thank you 
Yes, Nirupama. Anything else that you want to? Bird, bird or theme also, I think you differentiated. Lack bird, also. I already said. So lack yes, also, sir. people came with the animal kingdom and all. We have, I think, five minutes, ten minutes, if you want to. Hey, yeah. Lack, I told you. Like, uh, some lack of wants to be in home, right? They, uh, home is the nurture place for them. Uh, so they don't reject home completely, right? Here, cactus wants to go out of home. The whole energy is on going out, not staying at home. Mammals, the whole energy is staying in home. That is how you will differentiate. Here, this patient didn't even say once about the mother or father. Only once he said about the father. He will guide me. Otherwise, he didn't say anything. For him, home was not a nurturing place. Second case, also if I, uh, which I showed, that child also felt a lot of strictness, domination, and she went out of home. Two and a half years, she didn't come back home. And the word she used, my parents kicked me out. So that is how they themselves kick the womb. Yes, sir. They don't want to come back. Two and a half years is a big time. Right. right. And bird is the very, uh, I explained, it's a uh, adult stage, mature adult stage. You have achieved everything in life and now that's enough for me. And let me go out. I've done enough. Uh, somebody is asked, can we get a recording? It will be put up on the NJ's YouTube channel in, uh, in next, by next two weeks' time. So please look for it over there. And please uh, see all the things in which are given in the NJ's YouTube channel. Yes? Excellent, Dr. Nirupama. Super. Thank you. Thank you, Rama. A lot of... Uh, How is my Super so thank you very much. Yeah, yeah Nirupama. Thank very you. Good, very good presentation, good cases, and a lot of good compliments. People have uh, understood, you know, that uh, the NJH is a platform through which at least, you know, you get to learn the homeopathy through different angles, you know, uh, from mm -hmm. all the possible uh, 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 approaches that you can get to learn from uh, NJH. So, yes, participants, uh, do join us for uh, of the roundtables and the webinars that we have on every alternate Saturdays and uh, our, uh, telegram, engage on the Telegram group on which we are shortly going to start the academic activities which we have interrupted for a while due to some technical reasons. So, which will be starting soon on every Tuesdays. So, do join us over there. And also our journal next, this current issue which we are working on is on vitiligo, which promises to be really very exciting because it's a difficult subject and we don't get kids so easily. So do all of you keep in touch with that. And uh, yeah, hope those all of you are life members or you can become. Yeah. yeah, those who are not yet life members do try and contact any of the uh, EB members of the NJH and become a life member soon to get the maximum uh, from the NGH to learn homeopathy in the best possible way. So I'm giving a Munira's number for uh, getting your uh, whatever other information you want. Hmm. Preeti, can you put your number also, please, if they want any other information? Shobha? Uh, yes, ma'am. So I really like the way there has been so much interaction and answering everybody's question so that they don't go away feeling that they have not understood the case. Even, uh, you know, even small little questions we answered. So yes, please uh, feel free to ask us anything. So it's a very open and very supportive group that we have here. And everybody explains to the best of their ability. So keep in touch. Anyone, anything you want to say, Nirupama Shobha, and we can close. Mm -hmm.
Mm, no, ma'am. I was trying to give his number, but it wasn't going. So, Nirupama, I look forward to your next webinar also soon. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so, second and fourth, always keep in touch with us Saturdays, every Tuesday, every uh, Saturday. Other Saturdays, by next Saturday, we'll have our newsletter also coming up. So, whatever way you like to keep in touch with us, you're welcome. Our issues come out on the 18th of every month without fail, like clockwork. So, yes, so we do lots of things for you. Yeah, do some doctors are asking about the link to join the Telegram group. Please, we have shared you two numbers of Munira and Preeti. Please contact any of them or you can contact any of the EB members and we will add you in the Telegram group. Okay, then, good night, everybody. Yeah, thank you very much and good night, everybody. Wonderful uh, mm -hmm. session, Nirupama. Thank you very much thank for the Ma'am, are we meeting? Ma'am, are we meeting after this? Yes, immediately. Okay. That lot of Thank people you. also said that we have used cactus as a heart remedy or as a uh, specific yeah. remedy, but we haven't used it as a uh, deeper acting constitutional okay. remedy. And they got to learn this from you. So that was a nice learning. Yes. So uh, anything which too too much constriction and wants to break free uh -huh. is yes. yes, yes. Too much constriction. Very good. Wonderful. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, uh, Nirupama. Okay. Thank you, Nirupama. Thank you, madam. Thank you, Shobha. Thank you, everyone.